Detroit has a 10-win football team. The Lions got the job done against the Broncos, not in a cliche bounce-back fashion. The offense had 448 yards. Jared Goff threw five touchdown passes, and this rookie class, Sam Laporta and Jameer Gibbs, combined to find the end zone five times. The Lions dominated the Broncos, 42 to 17. We just needed to win, and we did that today. And uh, look, we just cleaned up, uh, just cleaned up a couple of things, you know, and focused on our job at hand. I thought golf played a. Uh, a really good game. A number of guys did. The old line played the rears off, and uh, you know, I mean, er everybody in there, you know, played big for us. But you know, we just we got to start faster than that. So it was good, and you know, it's a good win, man. Every team goes through ups and downs and lulls, and and we hit a little bit of a stumble there for maybe call it two or three weeks of of certainly our offensive play. And um, but we're the same team. We're the same guys, the same people, the same players, um, and just kept reminding us that. Laporta is putting together an all-pro season. The rookie tight end has nine touchdowns. That's pacing all tight ends across football. And this running back tandem of Gibbs and David Montgomery, they each have over 750 yards rushing. That's the first time in Lions history two backs have had that total in a single season. I'm not surprised by that. He just keeps getting better and better, and so does Gibbs. Gibbs is just getting better and better. So, um, you know, I'm just going to bring it back to Brad Holmes. It's a hell of a job by him once again, you know. Took a lot of criticism for those two picks, but they look like they're okay. So um, I'm glad we got them. They're, they're two of the best rookies I've ever been around. And like for, for what they handle mentally and what they do every Sunday for us and the way they practice, the way they're pros, everything, they're as good as it gets. Dan Campbell had a raspy voice in celebrating this win, walked into the press conference, and one of the last questions he fielded was about putting together this team, if this was what he envisioned. He looked at the reporter and said, what do you think? He talked about the recipe for success and believes the Lions can win different ways. In getting to 10 wins, he said, now they have to focus on getting to 11. The division, the playoffs, so much is at stake for this team. Now two of their final three games are against a division foe in the Vikings. At Fort Field, Brad Galley, 7 Action Sports.